Hey everybody, what is going on? I hope you guys are all doing well and welcome to another tutorial video. In this video, I'm going to be explaining to you guys how you can add images to your site on Squarespace. So let's get right into it. Now you can do this in two different ways. You can upload it directly to the page to the element block that you're using, or you can go ahead and upload it to your asset library first. And then afterwards, you will be able to use those assets in whichever page you would like. Now, the first thing we're going to do, I'm going to show you the assets version first. So what you're going to do is go into assets under website, and then you can get to your library. You can add new folders if you want, or you can just click upload and directly upload any images. You just select the image from your computer, click upload, and then it should upload into your assets library. Then you can add it to other pages. However, first, what we're going to do is we're going to go into the pages menu, and I'm going to show you guys how you can upload it directly here. Now I'll click edit on this page, and I already have a section here. I'm just going to delete the image block, and you can add a new section if you already have uh, all the sections filled up completely, or you can click on add block. Once you add block, as you can see, you can add an image. If you have an embed for uh, embedding pictures from certain other web websites or other locations on the internet, you can embed them. However, that's more of a complicated way. You can just click on image, add the image block, place it wherever you want, click on the plus, and you can either upload the file directly from your PC as we did for the asset library, or you can select from library. This will show you the asset library as well as all uh, placeholder images you've used or what what's it called? The uh, royalty-free images you've used through Squarespace. Uh, these are the ones I uploaded, and these two on either side are the ones from the library. And if I go into free images, as you can see, you have a lot of them which you can use. They're very useful if you're looking for a placeholder or just something for aesthetic purposes. You can search for whichever image you would like, and you can most likely find it under free images. Or you can go into premium images if you have a subscription for Squarespace and find something here. And yeah, you can select from your library as well, but that is pretty much it. Hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll be seeing you guys in another video.